to West Africa, in Nigeria, for instance, uh, my place in Anambra State, Oraoku, is the biggest farm in Nigeria. We've had different foreigners come to visit. Sure, in some weeks from now, some researchers from European countries are actually coming to visit us uh, to see what we're doing and um, also to do more research because they discovered a lot with vitamins. So many phytochemicals, like I said earlier, different tapins, the typins, flavonol, tannins, and also sesquatanipinus. So uh, it, it's amazing. Sesquatanipinus is actually uh, the compound responsible for that bitterness. You understand? Know, and that bitterness it needs is highly medicinal. But the problem we have in this part of the world is we like washing away the bitterness and just taking the vegetable. You see? So we remove the nutrients. We remove major medicinal properties. And we're just taking uh, the shaft, the nutrients, and all that. But thanks to technology these days, thanks to biotechnology, it can actually be dried, grinded in powder form, and encapsulated, or packed in tea bags and um, juice. Now, Vitalik also manages hypertension. Like I said, antihypertension, prostate cancer, breast cancer, ovarian cancer. It does actually a lot. So we'll be doing more training in farm. So it's highly, highly organic. Organic in the sense that everything is um, organic. So I'll talk about it being more organic and how and the process from farm to table at the farm. Thank you very much. I remain Andy Ochun. Hello, good afternoon. My name is Andy. Sorry, cause okay, can be the atom sorry. Hello, good morning. Uh, my name is Andy Kegnachi Ochumba. I'm an Greek printer and uh, also a vegetable, about a unique uh, vegetable. Uh, it's called Venonia amagdalina. Uh, and um, in our own local language, we call it bitter leaf in Africa. Now, it's unique to West Africa, uh, but here in Nigeria, uh, it's very known and used as a stable food in the eastern part of Nigeria. Now, as you can see, um, in this part, I'm in Anambra State. And what we have here is bitter leaf. Now, we are known for bitter leaf farming in Anambra State. And this is a, a particular vegetable that has unique and so many health benefits, medicinal benefits, seriously. And I'll be talking about that briefly when we get to the other farm. But one point I want to pick from here is this. Uh, bitter leaf has so many benefits. And what we do here is organic uh, farming. You know, what we do here is organic farming and it has so many health benefits. So, we, there's no chemical, there's no insecticide, there's no pesticide because most of our customers uh, that actually use it for medicinal properties actually prefer it to be organic. As you can see, it's 100, it's 100 naturally. You know? So, having said that, um, I'll be showing you briefly the organic fertilizer we use. What we use is chicken waste, poultry waste. That's what we use. And you can see how fresh and how good looking uh, they yeah, are. Yeah. So what we do here is uh, organic farming. So from preparation of the soil, to planting, to management of the farm, everything is all organic, you know? And uh, we use poultry waste as our manure. We use poultry waste as our manure. So there's nothing like chemicals here or any form of uh, insecticide or pesticide or any chemical because we are actually concerned about uh, health, really. Why? Because most of our clients, most of our customers in Europe, in Asia, are interested in uh, organic uh, uh, bitter leaves. You know? And like I said earlier, uh, the botanical name is Venonia amagladalina. Venonia amagladalina. So quickly, I'll be showing you the poultry waste you know, uh, we use as manure here. So this is the poultry waste. You know, this is the poultry waste. We actually collect this from the poultry, though very expensive these days. Uh, before, it used to be a waste product, but since we got into uh, uh, farming um, venture, it has become a scarce commodity. So this is organic, this is natural, and this is what we apply to the bitter leaf. So now we'll be entering the farm. This is just uh, the front side of the farm. We'll be entering the farm and we'll be covering a uh, different area of the farm. And what we do on a normal basis, on a daily, uh, on 
a daily basis. Okay?